Welcome to the FEMAP Tips and Tricks video series. In this video, we'll show you how to sweep a set of planar elements into a solid helical mesh using the Mesh Revolve Element command. I'll start with a simple model of a mesh of planar elements and a curve representing the center line of the helix. Select the command Mesh Revolve Element. You can also use the Mesh Revolve Element Face command if you want to rotate a set of solid element faces. After selecting the elements to rotate, you select the property of the elements to be generated and the total number of elements along the path of the helix. In this case, we'll specify 72 elements per 360 degree revolution and three revolutions. You also have the options to specify a bias, delete the original elements, and to match the original color and layers. Next, you define the axis of revolution of the helix. Additional inputs needed are the total angle of revolution, in this case, three revolutions times 360 degrees per revolution, and the total translation distance along the axis of revolution vector. In this case, the pitch distance is 25 with three revolutions. Since I selected the option to delete the original elements, I'm prompted to confirm that selection at the end. For more information, go to Siemens.com slash PLM slash FEMAP or contact your channel partner. Oh.